Okay, so this black piece here is the double action sear, and it's sitting on the back of this trigger ledge. So when the hammer gets pulled, it pushes up the double action sear in the hammer, it gets to its end of motion, it slips off, the hammer can fall completely. This comes down to relock, and you can see right there that the double action sear did not reset. I'm gonna nudge it forward, and there it reset. So the whole motion of what the problem we were having at the range is it slips off, the hammer drops, it comes back, but doesn't reset. So now the hammer cams forward and the cylinder turns.